Hey guys, I'm Ron and today I'll be showing you how to read JSON from a file and then parse that JSON using the org.json library. Let's do it. So let's begin by taking a look at our JSON file. So I created a file called Bob file and inside I have a person named Joe. He's 20. He has a list of emails, which is a JSON array and family. His family is a JSON object. So he has a spouse, Jane Schmo, and children, which are in a JSON array, Mike Schmo and Adam Schmo. So we have a complex object here. So we'll read from this file, and then we'll see how to parse its contents. We'll start by putting the contents of that JSON object into a string. So we'll create a new string. And the reason we're doing this is because we're going to use the read all bytes method. And here we have a dropdown of completions provided to us by Kudota. Kudota is a plugin that helps me code faster and with less errors by providing me with relevant suggestions and completions for my code. Let's continue. So I'll set the, f the file name to Bob file and I'll surround with a try catch to catch any exceptions. Now I'll create a JSON object and I'll put the contents into it so we can look up keys within this JSON object and easily extract data. And now we'll create a JSON array called emails and the key will be emails. So we're going to look for the emails key in our JSON object. This will return an array. Now we'll iterate over that array and Kadota knows that too. And we'll print out the emails. All these little completions with the Kadota icon next to them are provided by Kadota. So now, after doing that, we'll want to create a JSON object called family. And in here, we'll look for the family key in our JSON object. And now we'll want to print out the spouse. So the spouse is named. So we're going to want to print out family, get string, and in here we'll write spouse. So the key is spouse. And we're going to hope that we get the, the emails printed out, followed by the spouse's name. So Jane Schmo. Let's run it. And here we have it, guys. So we have the two emails and the spouse's name. That's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If it helped you, leave a like and subscribe. And don't forget to download Kodota. I'll leave the link down below. I'll see you next time. Bye.